Hi, this is Heath from Riffmaster Pro, and on this video, uh, we're going to do a slightly uh, quick video on the new updates uh, from Apple with uh, 9.2, iOS 9.2, and the changes with Riffmaster Pro and loading songs from iTunes. So, uh, in that case, what we're going to do is go to Riffmaster Pro straight away, and then uh, we're going to add a song from the iTunes library. And I'm going to look for a white snake song called Here I Go Again, and there it is. And as you can see, it's popped up a little uh, warning there that I need to make this song available offline. Now, this song I've already purchased on iTunes, so this only works for songs that you've purchased on iTunes, uh, obviously. So, what we need to do is just go to iTunes and I'll head to my iTunes app and I'm going to look for that particular song. my music it will be and there it is there and what we need to do is to make this particular track available offline so you'll see the iCloud icon there right next to the artwork and you tap that icon and what you'll see is it will start to download onto the device so then it will be available to Riffmaster Pro to use. So whenever there is a, a little device icon there with a tick in it, then uh, you'll be able to use that in Riffmaster Pro. So let's head back to Riffmaster Pro and then we'll go back and browse our iTunes library and we'll look for that song. And there it is, and it is dropped into the bottom of the playlist. And then you can tap on that, and there is the song right there that we can use to uh, 